President Trump is ending a program that shielded hundreds of thousands of immigrants from deportation. The administration says it will begin withdrawing about 800,000 work permits from people who were protected by the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals or DACA program. As to what to do with those people, the Trump administration has put it on Congress to work out a solution. Well, included in those affected are immigrants here in Tulsa. News on 6's Sawyer Bussey is on the story after hearing from two Tulsans living in the United States States under DACA. We moved here to the United States when I was 11. I came to the United States when I was three years old. My parents crossed the border. Meet Amy and Sarah. We're not using their real names or showing their faces because they're afraid of deportation. I'm just in the limbo knowing that they can come and knock on my house anytime. They tell me entering the country illegally is not something they would have chosen for themselves, but it is their reality and they choose to make the best of it. It's the American dream. That's all we want. Sarah graduated high school, fell in love and had children. She tells me when President Obama signed DACA, she was able to start a career and provide for her family for the first time. This is my country. I pledge of the legends every football game because that's what I've known all my life. Once Amy was approved for DACA, her family had to go back to Mexico and told her to stay behind to continue her education. She's working her way through college and hoping to get into law school. I haven't seen my mom for almost three years. I haven't been able to go visit my dad's funeral or put flowers. <laughs> And that's just something I want to do without being terrified of not being able to come back. On Tuesday, the Trump administration announced it's phasing out the program. Amy and Sarah tell me they're afraid the futures they worked so hard for could be taken away. I have family in Mexico, but I wouldn't be able to go back to what? When my whole life is here? My future? My kids? It's not an easy life dreamers live. Or a DACA recipient, I have put some links online with instructions on what you can do next. On the scene, on the story, saw your busy news on six.